Well, ladies and gentlemen, it's an election year, and you know what that means. The GOP is going to pretend to have principles and a backbone because they want to look like they're actually doing what the people want. This is from Fox News. GOP plans to grind Senate to a halt if Democrats table Mayorkas impeachment trial. Remember, Republicans only have a spine when they have no, pro no chance of achieving the thing they're attempting to do. Roughly a dozen GOPs are threatening to force Majority Leader Chuck Schumer's hand. Exclusive Republican senators are gearing up to prevent all legislative business in the Senate from going forward if they don't get a full trial into the Articles of Impeachment against Homeland Security Secretary Alejandro Mayorkas. Six can or sources told Fox News Digital that roughly a dozen GOP senators have decided to pretend that they are principled and will actually do the things that the voters want them to do. Of course, they're going to make a giant grandstand about it, send it out in their fundraising emails, and then tell you that they need more money and more votes, and then they can definitely achieve something next year if you give them a bigger majority. Uh, they're going to plan to obstruct the uh, legislative proceedings and regular business in the Senate. Senate if at a minimum, points of order are not agreed to in the impeachment trial of Mayorkas when the House impeachment managers deliver the articles to the Senate Major Majority Leader Chuck Schumer, Democrat, New York. The Senate runs on unanimous consent. A uh, Senate Republican aide familiar with the talks told Fox News Digital, any one senator can do that. Aid, or the aide revealed that the conversation has been ongoing since last week. A certain set of facts or points of order will need to be agreed to once the impeachment articles arrive in the Senate before any trial can take place. We go about a process to negotiate the precise procedure, uh, meets, and bounds of this particular impeachment proceedings. That's a terrible way to put that. It just, it, it should either be these uh, proceedings or this proceeding. Is this an editor problem or is it a senator problem? My money's on both. Uh, senator Mike Lee, Republican Utah, described at a press conference on the Mayorkas impeachment on Tuesday. <clears throat> at the same conference, Senator uh, John Kennedy, Republican of Louisiana, noted that Senate President Pro Temper Patty Murray, Democrat Washington, would preside over the proceedings. She doesn't have to rec recognize us. That's entirely possible that Senator Schumer will tell her to only recognize him, and we won't have a chance to make a point of order, he said. A second Senate Republican aide also confirmed that several senators are voicing support for slowing or even stopping legislative business if impeachment is tabled. That is basically what the, uh, the filibuster is all about. You're supposed to use that to try and help move things along in a way that services both the uh, the majority and the minority. Remember, those who say that the filibuster needs to go away want to take away the voice of the minority. They want true democracy, which is mob rule, which ends up being tyranny of the one who is able to get the mob to vote for them for just a minute. Uh, Schumer's office did not immediately provide comment to Fox News Digital. A top Senate Republican source shared that this type of holdup is always possible in the upper chamber, noting that one senator can choose to object at any time. However, they said a halt of this nature was going to be more likely if the articles were delivered this week. And they're actually more likely to be delivered next week because basically most senators are going home. But the fact of the matter is, in an election year, we have the opportunity to press our senators and congressmen to do something and push them a little bit harder. But it's important to remind them every single day that their jobs are on the line. So make sure their phone numbers are saved in your phone and their email addresses. They're not allowed to block you. As long as you don't break any laws, you can tell them anything you want, including calling them morons and cowards and letting them know that you plan to vote against them if they don't do what you tell them to do. It does work, believe me, and it's totally legal to bully your congressman. Let me know what you think in the comments, then head over to my Locals page where you will get exclusive content that you won't find anywhere else and a link to my Gilded server where I'm trying to grow my community. Until next time, thanks for watching.